na waumini wa kanisa katoliki huko nchini walijiunga na wenzao ulimwenguni kuadhimisha Jumatano ya majivu ambayo inaashiria mwanzo wa kipindi cha mfungo wa siku 40 katika kanisa la Holy Family Basilica jijini Nairobi Waumini wa kanisa katoliki huko nchini walimiminika kuadhimisha mwanzo wa mfungo wa siku 40 almaarufu kwa resma Ni kipindi ambapo wakristo wanahimizwa kujinyima kusali na kuwasaidia wasiojiweza katika jamii kama njia moja kurejesha uhusiano baina yao na Mwenyezi Mungu Kazisi Profesa John Lukwata alihimiza umoja miongoni mwa Wakristo na kuwajali wengine. We live in a world that is full of uh, uh, misery and suffering. And Jesus came to take away our misery and suffering. And he has told us whatsoever you do to the least of my brothers and sisters you are doing it to me. We are urging people to be generous to be charitable to be more prayerful waumini hao walielezea umuhimu wa siku hii kwa maisha yao to me lent represents sacrifice and prayer yeah time for sacrifice and really praying and getting closer to god i see this as a chance of reflection of my journey of life and i uh, getting another chance to experience god in a different way to experience jesus love and uh, grow into maturity with him, with him it offers us a chance to repent our sins carry out an introspection you know as believers because at the end of the day what are we without the lord hali ilikuwa sawia katika kanisa la mtakatifu an huko muture katika eneo la kabete wakati wa kristo walipojumuika kuadhimisha siku hii ambayo hatima yake ni kukumbuka kuteswa kufa na kufufuka kwa yesu kristo So tunakumbushwa kwamba haya majivu tunapopakwa ni tuwe ndani yetu tunakumbushwa kwamba kuwa na moyo wa kutubu moyo wa kurudia Mwenyezi Mungu moyo wa kutushirikisha na huyu Mungu na hasa kuweka maisha yetu yakiwa matakatifu Na uko ndumberi katika kaunti ya Kiambu Kasisi John Muroki wa parokia ya Riara aliwahimiza Wakristo kutoa msaada kwa wenzao wanaokabiliwa na bala njaa katika maeneo mbalimbali huko nchini whatever we deny ourselves we are able to give to our brothers and sisters to help them spiritually those who are not able to come closer to god through our own actions through our own teachings through our own lifestyle through our change of behavior and attitude we are able then to bring all these people closer to god Trevor Ngendo Darubini